war is ugly. It's, it's not pretty. But 9-11 um, wasn't pretty either. And uh, these men and women give, they write a blank check to this country and said, I'll give my life to save this country and the freedoms that we have. They came home, but they're changed people. You know, just totally changed people. They're, they're depressed, they're angry, they have survivor's guilt. Um, they have flashbacks, they have nightmares. They come home, but uh, they're not the same people. So we have a responsibility to these veterans, these men and women, to take care of them. Um, and that's what we try to do at Canines for Warriors. Well, as proud as I was of him for doing that, uh, he came home um, a different person. And I, I didn't know who he was. And it became very apparent to us that he was suffering from post-traumatic stress disorder. try to start a program that helps veterans with PTSD and provide them with service dogs because we had done um, a little research on it and that's when the light came on it came back on and he, and, uh, he started to come back literally come back home Axel saved my life. There's no, no doubt about it, hands down. If Axel hadn't come into my life, if Canine's Word hadn't come into my life, I would be dead. No doubt about it. There, there aren't words to express the gratitude that I have for Canines for Warriors. How do you, re, how do you repay somebody for giving you your life back? Canines for Warriors is a life-saving organization that has changed my life and many of those close to me dramatically. I wanted my own son back. I wanted his, his son, my grandson, to have his daddy back, his wife to have her husband back, and then just replicate that by thousands all across this country. How do they feel? That's, they feel like I felt. Where did they go? They, they didn't come home. He's home now. For that, I'm grateful.